Hey everybody, how's it going? It is Axel Grave and I'm back with more reactions with an X. This time, happy to bring you the next episode of Tacked Off Destiny. That's right, we're on episode 5, and it's going to be a hell of a time. While last episode wasn't necessarily super amazing, the three episodes before that in the series as a whole have been absolutely spectacular. Great art, great animation, uh, good style, good music, good voice acting, good story. I mean, it all has done really well in such a short amount of time. And I have to say, I've been thoroughly impressed with a show that I knew nothing about until the day I started watching it, basically. So uh, that that you can't get much better than that. You know what I mean? I mean, you obviously, I'm sure you could. But the point is, like, what more could you ask for than what you like? And I'm liking this a lot. I'm excited to see where it goes from here, what the story and the plot are really going to evolve into, because there seems to be a very kind of maybe secret of elaborate massive plot sitting in the back that we really have not touched on deeply at all, but has been hinted at a couple of times with like Lenny and other people. I don't know. Tell me what you guys think. I'd really love to hear your opinions either in the comments below, live while we do these on Twitch every Sunday, or you know, uh, you can always check out our Discord, which is also linked below on the YouTube videos, so you can come chat with us about all our anime, the music, the video games, all the other stuff we do as well. So come and say hello. You can join our community. We have a bunch of fun people in there who you know are trying to kick it together, and we try to keep it as chill as possible. So yeah, hope you guys enjoy it as much as these videos, and uh, yeah, we'll have a great time. With that said, we're gonna kick into episode five and enjoy ourselves. Hopefully. They're gonna try to do something and I realize this bitch is pumped up on power steroids. They're gonna try to do something stupid and get fucked up, aren't they? And the reason I say that isn't like they're super skilled, but they had already covered the fact that Cosette is um, stronger than regular music artists. Like she's, she has no tuning or limiter. She just goes full out power and it fucks him up so bad. Whereas the other ones are designed to limit their power so they don't fuck people up. Valkyrie looks like we're equitation. Interesting. <laughs> other than music, your ability to do anything is subpar. Tell him, boy. There's a D2. <laughs> of course, that was good writing. She doesn't even wait. She's just gone. Jesus, bruh. Like that. That's what I'm saying. And then it's gonna hit a train. The train's gonna get it. She really likes. Jeez. They gotta go that hard for some random D2? Oh, she's gonna get hit by a train? Oh, it's trying to stop for her. Move, dummy! Oh, it stopped for her? Oh, she got in their way, literally. That's a really good train if it could stop for her. Just saying. Oh, hey, look, it's the square. That's an interesting uh, symbol. Where the... What the... Oh, they are. Okay, so they're going from... They're, I thought they were going the other way. So they lived on the west coast and they're going to the east coast. How did they get that up there? Black Knight Siderites? I don't trust this dude. Uh, and then he just looks away and doesn't pay attention. said i don't think i was like if you fight in the train that's traveling with the siderite like you brought a threat on board which is a totally bad idea they like said even if they were stronger there's no way they could disable her with but poor stopping her from doing serious damage to that train and likely ruining their mission and probably fucking other people Damn. Damn. Dude. Damn, son. Damn. 
です。Oh no, she's gonna burst through the side of the train like an idiot. Oh, she did not actually entirely annihilate the train for once, which is insanity. No, alright, she still fucked it up real bad. I thought she just, you know. And the train stopping. She blew up the fucking mountain in front of them like an idiot, didn't she? Yeah, she did, didn't she? I can already tell. Because the beam went so far forward. Look at it. Uh oh. What the hell? Oh, yeah, he blew. Oh, no, never mind. Maybe it wasn't. Because I don't think she hit the ground. They're literally gonna have to build. Oh no, it was them. Oh wow, that's a lot of D2s, bro. That's a lot. I mean, they're the flying weird ones, so maybe they're not as strong. She was clapping them pretty fucking easy, but. <laughs> they must have got night. They got nicked. That or it's her. She might attract the E2s. I don't know. That was a smooth action there. Oh, wow. Interesting, bro. Let the performance begin. All the times. That's right. He gets fucked up real easy. Oh. I've never really seen her like that. That's... Pop. Already tired. Oh. Conductor,契約していない無事化とは力の勝負を繰り返し長時間戦えば合わせた。もっともっとだ。He is an insane human being. That's the thing, like, when they show stuff like that, it's so important for writing to show his character. To show why he does well as opposed to others, right? It's not that he's stronger. He's stronger. It's that he's, one, smarter, right, at the using, but two, he's willing to give it all. He does not care at all. He wants all of those D2s dead. He does not give two fucks about his own life at the moment. He wants to play music and kill D2s, and that's his entire existence. And her, just kill D2s and eat sweets, but mostly kill D2s. Does he see potential and that doesn't attack, or does he see potential and wants to eliminate? Because he can do both. Both are... Walkure. So she's... Ah, uh, Wagner. Walkure. Oh, she's easily flustered. Uh oh. Uh oh. What the f is that? What even is that? It doesn't even look like an animal! I am... Oh, she's bored now. Okay, yeah, she wants to go beat it up. She's a monster. She's a monster. Hell? Her name's Hell? Which composer did they pull that one from? Any number. What the f... She has rollerblade feet. Fall together? Oh, it's that voice actress. I recognize that fucking laugh. Look at this shit. Is that her weapon too? Every one of them is so unique. It's like a deer god. And it is her weapon. She cut it in half like absolutely nothing. Oof. She wasn't using any giant attacks. She just cut it in half like nothing. Oh yeah, she... Psycho? Is that what she said? Did she say psycho? Am I crazy? 
What's going on, boys? I wonder how he'll take this. He does. He seems so flush. He seems so sure he was gonna say yes. I have no idea why he thought that guy was just gonna say it. They literally just drove off right away. So this is where the problem goes. Look at her crazy face. Oh no, now he's mad. Attacked Asahina. Forget this. Or the name. Yeah, fine. I'm not gonna lie. All right, at least this one was actually on par. This was opening up for the whole show. All right, guys. Um, that was a good episode. Uh, I also just realized it was our second in the list. Much better than the last one in the sense of like, um, you know, it actually had big story impact and movement, right? Like it was moving to broaden the world add more music arts add more to the symphonica add a new character as like a potential enemy a foible later um to show us progression in the d2s in several different unstated ways one the number right like that's a high number of d2s to show up period they even said even with the the transferring of the the thing they said it was sealed but even before that's more mu that's more d2s than we have ever seen before and then the last d2 was just a fucking monster that was those two were basically the the problem is they didn't have that they there was only one mistake there and that was they didn't have the that new weird looking d2 do anything so we're not actually sure how strong it was at all we just assumed by its size weird shape coloring and the music it was really strong and i think it's safe to assume that because the whole point of that was to show how strong the other music art hell is as opposed to valkyrie or i i Volker, which i think is just valkyrie in another language i don't i don't know what's going on with her name and how he pulled it i'm not as musically inclined as tack that's for fucking sure but once again an episode where the animation was on point the music was on point the plot was on point i love the characters for most of it i mean it was absolutely a great episode and i think once again this is just going to be a very good series all around it's going to be one of those solid animes all around just my opinion but i really do hope that other people check this out if they see this review i absolutely recommend checking out tacked up destiny and if you want to watch with us you can always check us out on our patreon where you can get the footage live well not live but you know you can get a full uncut you can watch us live on twitch uh and for as low as a dollar a month you get those pre-cut you know the audio stuff as opposed to the cut stuff we have to put on youtube with the filter and all that bullshit uh, which I really don't want to do, but it is just something that has to be done to avoid copyright strikes and to keep our channel alive. Um, and same with the Patreon. You know, if it was up to me, I'd give everything away for free. But I, too, have bills to pay and got to pay rent. So we try to make the best of it. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you did enjoy, remember to like, comment, subscribe. And also remember to support the original content creator. Because without them, we wouldn't get great shows like this, like Tech Top Destiny, like... Jujutsu Kaisen, like all these other great new anime that are coming out, you won't get those unless you support the original artists, you support their original content, where whether it be anime or manga, and throw down a little of those hard-earned dollary dues. Uh, it's up to you guys, but I know I definitely want to do the same. I'm try, you know, I pay for Crunchyroll for that very reason because we use it so much. I think it would just be wrong not to. I try to buy merch, I try to buy manga when I can. Can't always, and I understand that, but gotta love showing the support you know with that said thanks for watching i'll catch you guys next time on reactions with the next tacked up destiny